So if anything is great come out of the pandemic, which is a weird sentence to say all in one, is the RV industry and being able to get outside and enjoy your families in this life and world. Tow behinds, fifth wheels, motorhomes, diesel pushers, this is the way of the future to go work from home, go see the nation and turn off the TV and enjoy yourself because this is an available lifestyle for you and me. So behind me today, I got a lightly used 2018 Newmar Dutch Star 4018 floor plan. They're very hard to find in the nation, so if you're sitting there watching this on your computer, Google search availability for this coach, you'll see that mine is probably one of just a couple. So this walkthrough is to help you guys see the options, the way I have this thing ordered originally when it was bought brand new, and to really highlight what matters on a pusher for you guys in your lifestyle. This motorhome here is a 50th anniversary Newmar coach. Made in 2018, there was options made on this motorhome that were specific to that year. Starting with the exterior, that's called Sea Pearl. The Sea Pearl exterior, based on BASF paint, absolutely accentuates those darker colors when the sunlight hits it. Today's September 29th, and I have a beautiful sun highlighting in the sky, this coach, special for you guys, and it's already fall. So looking at the side of this coach, you get those chrome bezel features on the bottom cargo doors. This coach was ordered with that option to just give a little bit more shine offset from the paint. And at 40 feet, 10 inches, you have a ton of pass-through space on this coach. In that mid cargo bay, you have a full slide tray that is accessible on both sides of the coach. So those long items, things that you need spacing for, you have all that space accessible on both driver's side and passenger side of this motorhome. Being a 40 foot coach, Newmar sets the tone in the series of Highline coaches of having a tag axle at this length of a motorhome. Not only is it a tag axle coach, it's a steerable tag axle. So a steerable tag axle means that when you're getting into those tight spaces and campgrounds, places that are a little bit more difficult and you're worried about the turning radius, the steerable tag has the ability to cut at a 17% further ratio past already that normal 55 degree front wheel cut. So long story short, the tag axle wheels are cutting inward when you're making your left and right turns to allow this coach to cut tighter. Awesome feature to have at 40 feet. Only 40 footers from Newmar offer the tag axle. Let's head inside. The options ordered on this coach are absolutely exceptional and they stand alone to this brand and special to this brand. Come on in. So in 2018, there were still great features that had just been started onto the Dutch Star series line. Dutch Star being a 20 plus year namesake to the Newmar series line, there's certain things on this coach that really just separate it apart. One of them being the porcelain tile floor that started back in 2015-16, removing the carpet from the driver's side slide, turning that driver's side slide into a hydraulic slide that lifts up and in to maintain that weight ratio for that slide. So no carpeting is kind of the direction of the industry in general. It's a gorgeous feature. It is porcelain tile down the entire coach. This coach being ordered with opposing couches, the other option for the 4018 was theater seating, rather recliners. This opens up to a queen size mattress and you have two full size adult spacing of sleeping, opposing a single sleeper on the passenger side. Up until about 2018, they still optioned this coach. If you wanted it, you could have a propane cooktop from the Dometic series line. So it has a three, pay, a three stage burner for propane. Uh, it's not an induction cooktop, but you do have the convection microwave above that still. So this option is pretty nifty for folks that still like that traditional cooking. And you do actually get the extra counter space for prepping your meals. So this is a nice tuck away feature that you have in the kitchen space that allows you to have extra prep space when you need a little bit more of that countertop. The kitchen though, opposes the booth dinette. So the booth dinette, this is called the Euro booth, is an excellent option to have if you need extra space around the dinette for sitting. The table expands all the way out. You have two more leafs that you put inside the table there. So six people can sit here, two very, very comfortably. But the nice option for this is those game nights. When you have people over, card nights, games, everyone has a decent amount of space to kind of sit around the booth and play comfortably. Or if you have folks over and you have people sitting up in the cockpit seats, on the couches, everyone kind of want to, wants to talk in a circular environment, 
this allows you to sit comfortably and not necessarily be pinned up against the standard seating you know backboards so i like to point that feature out it really helps build the idea and help you guys visualize how are you going to live in this coach how is it going to be for you actually on the road uh, it is a bath and a half so as we go down the galley space here you got the corner cut toilet on the back side of the wall opposing your sink and your medicine cabinet so the half bath really gives that option for people visiting separate from the master bedroom that we'll get into here shortly posing that half bath is the residential whirlpool refrigerator it's 19.7 cubic foot has an ice maker beneath and it has the water filtration regular water that you can fill up your cup right from the front of the door and to the left is the pantry space so extra food extra space needing they are pull out drawers and it is all led lit and this is where you can kind of hide all that extra food from the cabinets that you don't have really space for in the main kitchen so the master bedroom does have a king size bed that's a residential king size bed it's not an rv king has rounded corners on the end but that's just for walk around space your king size sheets beddings pillows all that normal stuff, not necessarily the pillows, but your sheets for your blankets, everything will fit on this residential king. It's the same stuff you have at home. So it makes it nice on the savings point. You don't have to go buy anything specific for the RV, sheets wise. Opposing the bed is where your television, Sony television, and your hanging closet space is on both sides of the TV. Uh, six cabinets below. So the, the usage of space for all your hanging clothes is adequate. It's, it's not minimal. You have space on both sides and there's enough space for everyone to put their clothes away. The master bathroom is where you really get your space on the coach at 40 feet. You have the 30 by 30 standing shower, but it does have the fold down seat. So the fold down seat is, is efficient for folks that like to take their time in the shower. You know, you have the, the, the top side spigot that you can pour the water down, or you got the handheld wand that you can use as well if you're taking your time sitting in the shower. Or if you just need to get in and out, fold that chair up, and you have the space within the 30 by 30. All adequate use of space. Lastly, your toilet is placed against the passenger side door. That door back there is an emergency exit door, full size. Um, and to the left of that, when you're sitting on the toilet, is the washer and dryer location. This being a lightly used coach, these folks did order it. So your benefit is, is having that stackable already placed in the coach, plumbed and ready to go. Uh, that's the big benefit of lightly used motorhomes and finding one of these. So if this is the right coach for you guys, after highlighting those major features, a um, couple other options really quick, the flooring, the flooring's heated. Yes, just in case you were wondering, low, medium, and high setting does have heated floors. So what'd you think? Do these options make sense to you? Is this the right coach for you guys to go hit the road with? Is everything on this motorhome you dreamed of, can you visualize yourself exploring the open road with this motorhome? If you're answering yes to any of those questions, this is the time to give me a call right there or email me and let's do a test drive because that's the next step. Everything else we can work out. So just remember from the RV Shopa guy, yesterday's gone, tomorrow is not promised, so go adventure today because that's what we have is one day, guys. Let's get out there and enjoy it and I would love to take you for a test drive. Thanks.